Hello everyone, my name is Bernie Whitaker, but you probably already know that from the name of the channel. And this is uh, hopefully my last video about uh, porn addiction. So uh, I think I finally figured it out. The, the final piece of the puzzle, you know, the, the last thing you need to just get rid of all of it. You know, it's, it's like a, where should I put this? It's like a cross wires, basically, like, like, if you want to get rid of any any urge, any temptation to ever go back to that kind of stuff, even though you've had many chances, like it, like pornography is just it's watered down nowadays. You know, it's harder to get to. You know, you have a lot more on your plate nowadays now throughout life, but you still you still always go back to it. Uh, this this should help. So think back to a time when you were a kid. And you just discovered what the stuff was, you know, from uh, puberty and stuff or friends showing it. Now, uh, just try and think back of what something that you did as a kid while you're doing that. You know, a hobby, a thing you did, some kind of secret you had or, a, you know, an activity. Uh, now, that may be intertwined with uh, your addiction since, you know... You know, it's cross wires basically. Like, like the uh, they're, they're they're both in your head. You know, they're they're something you always go back to. Whenever you go back to one of those things, you always go back to the other. You know, if if maybe this has happened, have you ever? Whenever you've gone, you know, on the computer looking that stuff up. When you're done, have you ever gone back to? Uh, did you ever go back to? something you did as a kid, like that thing you always do. If so, then most likely those things are cross wires. Like in order to really get rid of this addiction, you basically have to stop doing this thing you did as a kid. And I think that's fine because if it's something you did as a kid, then it's probably not important now. So that's fine. You know, like say uh, origami. If you did origami as a kid and you kind of did more on the side, those things are probably intertwined. You know, those two things from they 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 remind you of each other. You know, it's it's best to just you know get rid of that hobby and find another hobby. You know, something that's more purposeful. I'm not saying origami is not purposeful. Just you know, it, there's probably some things you do better for time. You know. You know, the best way to truly escape this is getting rid of the past, you know, growing up, getting rid of, not getting rid of your childhood, just getting rid of things from your childhood that you pretty much hold on to. That's the best way to move on. It's the best way of saying it. And then the second thing is uh, the dependency for attention. This is probably already intertwined with, you know, childhood. You know, we, if, if some, some of us have had neglected neglectful parents some of us never really had that many friends which is why you know this was such an easy source you know we had so much attention high speed attention from several people across the world basically just clinging to your most just just most basic uh, form of stimulation you know the, the best way to get rid of that is you know finding friends you know get get a hobby and maybe you'll find friends from that or heck you know try and reach out from friends from the past you know even if it was like i don't know some uh middle school bully maybe maybe he's grown up maybe she's grown up what can i say you know those those are basically the last two uh numbers in this formula last the last parts of the solution you know Get rid of all the things that remind you of your addiction and then find someone who can, you know, keep your attention, keep your focus away from this stuff that you want to get rid of because you already know it's not good for you. You already know you have better things to do. So it's best to just burn that bridge, you know, pass that train track. That's the best way I can put it. All right. That being said, hope this helps and uh get good.